Hi guys, I'm Astrid and I'm so excited for this video because this is my first video in English and I'm so happy for that. Um, today we're gonna be comparing two foundations. One is almost $25 and the other one is only $10. Yeah, I know I look so bad but this is my face in the end of the day, you know, I was on the street all day and I don't have my face clean at all so i just going to clean right now with my salabi i love salabi it's not expensive it's a makeup remover towelist and it's so perfect the last month i bought the vitamin c but this month i chose green tea and it's well i like it but i like more the vitamin c but this is good like you can buy it too yeah, this is my face. This is my real face. Jesus Christ. You know, this is normal, I think. Because I live in the um, Caribbean, so... You know, I have the sun in my face all day. And this camera is so perfect. Just hide all this. Do something for me. I don't like this high quality. Because I see all my imperfections and I look so bad. You know, I don't like the high quality right now. Okay, I finished with this. Now my face is clean. The first thing that I applied in my face is the primer. And I buy it in this way, you know, spray. Because I really, I really enjoy doing this. Like, I feel like so fresh. The two foundations that I'm going to be comparing, Maybelline Superstay and Mary Kay, time-wise. <laughs> Mary Kay is almost $25 and the Maybelline Superstay is just $10. They are supposed to do kind of the same thing. They're made to give you perfect skin for photos and camera and all the stuff, so the time, all that. This is for you, this is for a perfect skin. So let's start with the Maybelline Superstay. Um, it's a full coverage foundation up to 24 hours. 24. Oh my god. All three. That's the most important for me. And dust and cloud pores. Oh my god. That's mean a lot. So the Mary Kay time wise is infused with vitamin E. Mmm, that's so good. And it's all free too. In the end of the video, I'll be using both of them. One will be on one side of my face and the other one in the other side of my face. So, let's start this right now. Whoa, so mad. But I love it and it's only $10 and it's so mad. I really feel drier like fresh. Okay, let's do the other side With Mary Kay time-wise oh. Whoa This is the other side. I really feel my old skin with this foundation. And I feel like I need to use more for full coverage. And with this, I just feel 
perfect and this is $25 this is more expensive I have to feel more comfortable with this foundation you know like people say because it's more expensive this is a drugstore makeup I love drugstore makeup because it's more cheap but it's good not all the makeup in the drugstore is good but you can find some products that really work like Maybelline because this is perfect and I look so bronze this is matte and this is liquid I think this foundation is for dry skin like if you really have a drier skin and you want to feel more oily it's, it's not oily I'm not saying it's oily but it's the map and when you have uh, all this skin you need a really matte you know my skin really needs that then of this I apply the powder and I use this for the powder and it's a forever 21 brush I just feel like Whoa. it's not much but I feel like it's the finish and I feel good When I see my face here, I really feel like this is shining. I don't want the glow in all my face because my skin is oily. So this is how I look and I really like it. guys I think this video is fine that like you don't have to buy expensive makeup for look great like you can buy uh, drugstore makeup not all of them but it's worth it like I really like the Maybelline side I feel more comfortable and my skin looks better and it's more I have in this side I feel I have the full coverage you know this is more expensive but I don't like it and I think this is about more how much money you want to spend by the makeup but I think you need to know that you don't have to spend a lot of money for a good good makeup that's my point so guys I feel so good because I finished this video I don't know how but I finished this is my first video in English I have another channel in Spanish and it's for the travelers so you can go there and you can subscribe it's in Spanish but if you speak Spanish or you want to learn Spanish you can go there because you're going to learn a lot with me because I speak a lot and when it's in Spanish I really speak a lot you know now I have to control myself because I have to think first so if you enjoyed the video just like the video and of course don't forget to subscribe to my channel just tap the bell for notified when there is a new video and of course thank you so much for seeing this video it's just one view two view i'm so so happy and i can't believe i did this i think this is a challenge for me it's a big challenge because i understand the english and i see movies and it's good when you talk with a friend and you talk always about the same things you know that English is good but this English talking about makeup is new for me like you know I never talk about makeup in English so I just read the description of the products in English and that's it and I understand and that's good but I didn't talk with someone about this because I'm not a makeup artist like I just like makeup and I really like the drugstore makeup and I just did it because I need to show to the world that I buy a drugstore makeup and I feel good so thank you so much for seeing the video and bye bye